welcome to the cz series today's question this was previously asked in the cz 2023 question paper let x be a positive integer such that 7x plus 96 is divisible by x how many values of x are possible in the option you can see 10 11 12 infinitely many what is the correct answer is answer 12 from which this question was asked this number system under number system the subtopic is factor theorem so let's analyze the question given is 7x plus 96 actually this is a number this number is divisible by x given this number is divisible by x divisible means x is the factor of the given number 7x plus 96 that is 7x plus 96 while dividing by x the remainder is 0 the remainder is 0 means x must be the factor of this 7x as well as x must be the factor of 96. So, this is the way of decoding the question. When 7x plus 96 is divisible by x means we can take 7x separately with this expression plus 96 by x separately. Here 7x by x, x and x got cancelled. So, this number is divisible by x because 7x is the multiple of x. What about this 96 value? Here, while x is divisible in 96 means x must be the factor of 96. Let's find what are the factors of 96. Those all factors may be the value of x. So, that much possibilities x will have. So, let's find the factors of 96. There are two ways to find the factors of 96. First thing, we can manually evaluate using the test of divisibility rule to find what are the exact factors. Method 2, just counting the factors. How many factors does 96 have? So, in both the ways, we are going to solve the problem now. Method 1 finding the factors of 96. In this method 1, I am just going to apply the test of divisibility rule with few numbers. So, 96 being a simple two digit numbers, we can use this test of divisibility rule. Starting with number 1. 1 is divisible in 96. How many times? 96 times. So, 1 into 96, 96. The set of pairs of factors are 1 and 96. Let me check with the next number 2. 2 is divisible in 96 and how many 2's are there? 4 times 2 is 8, 8 times 2 is 16. So, 2 into 48 is another pair of factors. Let me check with number 3. 3 is divisible in 96. Yes, 9 plus 6, 15. So, I got the idea 3 is also divisible in that. How many 3's? 3 times 3, 2 times 3. Next one is 4. 4 into what? So, 2 times 4 is 8, 4 times 4 is 16. So, these are the values as of now I got. Next set 5 I am going to check because next number 2, 4 is 5, but 5 is not divisible in 9 to 6 as the last digit is not equal to 0 or 5. We can eliminate that. The next one is 6 we can take. 6 into what give you 9 to 6? 1 times 6 remaining 3, 6 into 16, 9 to 6. Next set 7. 7 is not divisible in 96 at all. So, leave that. Next number 8. 8 into what is 96? 8 into 12. 8 twelves are 96. So, these much of sets as of now I have got. So, 9 I am checking 9 is not divisible. 10 I am checking 10 is not divisible. 11 is also not divisible. Again 12. 12 into what 8? Here the numbers are repeating. Whenever you get the repeated values 8 into 12 means 12 into 8 you are getting. You can stop the process of finding the extra factors because this is the ending point. 
of finding the factors hereafter if, if if you find any factor that will be in the repeating mode already it was taken into account that it means so just count the number of factors 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 therefore 12 different factors 9 to 6 have there are 12 different values for x any of this value may be given to x method 2 of finding the number of factors in this case you will not be able to get the actual factor just we can count the number of factors let's find that method 2 so in this method 2 take the number 96 do prime factorization in this prime factorization method starting the number with 2 so what is the value 48 times again 2 24 times 2 is 48 again 2 12 times 2 is 24 again 2 6 times 2 is 12 again 2 we can take finally we got 3 under the prime factorization method how many 2's are there 5 times 2 so you can write 2 power 5 into how many 3 only 1 time 3 you can write like this simply 9 to 6 can be rewritten as 2 power 5 into 3 power 1 so what is the number of factors are there take the powers plus 1 this is what actually factor theorem under this factor theorem we can count the number of factors like this and here power 1 add 1 with that this plus 1 is default okay plus 1 is default for every powers 5 plus 1 6 again 1 plus 1 2 so if you get the product of the powers along with added with 1 you will be getting 6 into 2 12 so how many factors that 9 to 6 have is 12 factors according to this so under any of the method you can get the answer 12 so answer for this question is 12 answer for the previous videos question what is the sum of all four digit numbers greater than 8000 formed by the digits 5 6 7 and 9 where none of the digits is repeated here the requirement is greater than 8000 using the numbers 5 6 7 and 9 so let me take number 9 in the thousands place remaining values hundreds tens digit unit digits in the remaining three places here we can make 5 6 7 is one variety of number another kind 5 7 6 next 6 5 7 next 6 7 5 next 7 6 5 another one 7 5 6 so in the thousands place number 9 is constant now how many different numbers we got six different numbers we need to find the sum let's take the sum 7 plus 7 14 6 plus 6 12 5 plus 5 10 how much do i get here is 36 so i put 6 here remaining 3 carry forward here also i can find the same thing 5 plus 5 double 5 double 6 double 7 so i will get the same 36 plus 3 39 remaining 3 again i can see the double 5 double 6 double 7 so that i got the value 36 plus 3 39 in the final spot i got number of nines how many nines 6 times 9 6 times 9 is 54 54 plus the remaining 3 57 so my answer is 57,096 which is option d so the correct answer is 57,096 Congratulations for those who gave correct answers. Question for today. Let x be a positive integer such that 23m plus 81 is divisible by m. How many values of m are possible? Post your answer in the comment section as usual. Meet you in the next session with another interesting question. Thanks for watching.